How's it going everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video I'll be teaching you guys two ways on how you can play uh, Call of Duty Mobile with a controller on PC. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So assuming that you guys um, have a PS4 controller or an Xbox controller, whatever, um, it works either way, uh, plugged in. So it could either be Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. Oh, not Wi-Fi, sorry. I actually meant uh, wired. In fact, I, I'd actually prefer wired as uh, there's no input lag when you press the buttons. So anyway, I digress. So um, once you have it plugged in, uh, either way, you would want to use the built-in button mapping uh, feature that the uh, PC emulators have for mobile. So let's say that you guys are playing um, uh, Call of Duty Mobile on PC using BlueStacks, right? So if you guys were using BlueStacks, it's actually quite simple to set up your controller to uh, work with uh, COD Mobile. So the way it works is uh, once you have BlueStacks open, you want to access settings. And there, there should be an option to uh, link BlueStacks with your controller, right? And there you get to configure um, the normal um, controls on your phone to your controller. So you could bind uh, movement like the, the joystick on your phone or rather the virtual joystick, you know, the one on the touch the touch screen so you would want to bind that to uh your left joystick on the controller and pretty much the same applies to all of the other buttons like uh right trigger left trigger uh x square triangle circle and whatnot the d-pad so it's pretty straightforward in fact uh, the same applies to uh the other the other emulator if you guys are playing on game loop then it's actually built in and to show you guys what i mean here's actually a guide saying that after you connect your controller click on key mapping using game loop and you'll see the uh, you'll see this setting on the right side of your screen and you must select gamepad instead of keyboard so um it's pretty straightforward you just want to bind the uh corresponding keys to match with uh, whatever action you want it to do in game so lastly check that you have selected the proper method uh for you so this could be used for multiplayer battle royale ob or bar and once uh, once you're done with that, you're done. Um, simply hit apply and you should be ready to use the controller to play Call of Duty Mobile on your phone. So yeah, that's how you guys do it. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you want to show your support for that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all of that said, thank you all for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.